your girl went shopping. If y'all don't know, Ipsy had its mega drop shop. I did go a little crazy. Well, I guess crazy is kind of subjective. For me, it's crazy. I went a little crazy and I bought a few things. Without further ado, let's go ahead and see what I got in this bag. Well, it's a box. I don't know why I say bag. The first thing that I ordered was the Rem Beauty On Your Color Plumping Lip Gloss. And this is what it looks like. I'm not gonna lie, based on the picture, I thought this was gonna be much bigger than it is. I, I don't know why that <laughs> happens to me all the time. I keep thinking these products are gonna be much bigger and then they turn out to be little itty bitty things. Like, is this a sample size? Oh. Oh, this is like a squeezy tube. I was not expecting that. This is what she looks like, okay? You take the little lid off and it's got like a little squeezy tube like this. So very cool. Uh, wish it was, you know, safety sealed. Your girl loves a good safety seal, but it's okay. I don't think anyone's been in my stuff. I don't see any residue on the outside. So it doesn't look like someone smeared this over their lips. This is a plumping gloss. So I'm guessing it's gonna have a bit of a tingle. Let's see what the color looks like on my hand. It squeezes out pretty nicely. It's sticky, okay? She's sticky. That's the color right there. It has a peppermint fe feel. It has a peppermint scent to it. So I'm guessing this is gonna be lip plumping in the same sense that like the Juicy Lip by ColourPop. Plop. ColourPop is a plumping lip gloss. So it's not gonna really hurt, but it's gonna just kind of give your, make your lips feel cold, I guess. Slight tingle sensation. I'm very excited to try this out. I think that is a very pretty color. You know, just a nice little flush of color. I was expecting expecting this to be a little bit bigger though, not gonna lie. But that's just a me error, okay? I should learn the sizing and what that actually means. The next item that I grabbed was the Aceology Hydro Glow Energizing Green Tea Eye Mask, and it comes with two. I think the reason why I got this was just so that my subtotal was enough to get the free item. <laughs> I think that's why I got these, but it's always nice to try some new eye masks. So I'm mad at it. And you get two, which is pretty cool. And I think Aceology is an expensive brand. Like usually their stuff is very pricey. We're gonna give these a try in a future nighttime skincare routine that you really shouldn't do, but I'm doing anyways because I'm filming videos. The next item that I got, and this one I'm super freaking excited about. This is the Cobb Cosmetics Tinted Lip Oil in the color Glamorous. Now y'all already know, I love, absolutely love their lip oils. Cobb Cosmetics has the best lip oils in my personal humble opinion. And it's nice to have a colorful one. So this is what it looks like. I'm almost through with my first lip oil that I have from Cobb Cosmetics. Oh yeah, that's juicy. Look at that. That is so juicy. This is a lip oil, so I'm not expecting a huge color payoff. It has like a cute little pink, pinky kind of tint to it. I am going to eat this up. This one doesn't actually have a scent. At least I can't tell one from, you know, smelling it in the tube. Very excited to try this out. I love Comp Cosmetics lip oils. And I love them so much that I got another shade. Okay, this is another Cop Cosmetics lip oil and this is in the shade Centerfold. I believe this one should be darker. Ooh, okay, that's not what I was expecting. Definitely not what I was expecting from the picture, but this is what it looks like. That is so pretty. I'm not mad at it. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this color, but I'm not, I'm not mad at it. This is what it looks like. Let's see if it looks different from the other one. Uh, I'm not really seeing much of a difference. I don't really think, well, I mean, it's, it's a little less opaque. That's the difference, it's less opaque. I'm not smelling anything, so I don't think the tinted lip oils have any scent to them. I mean, they're nice, they, they're nice. And I'm hoping they have the same feel on your lips as the regular one with no colors on it. I did a lot of lip products, so just brace yourself. The next product that I got was the LYS Beauty Speak Love Moisture Matte Lipstick. I love this brand. I think their stuff is so innovative and just high quality. I love the way it looks, the whole aesthetic of it. Um, I do want to do a full face of LYS Beauty. I got this so that I had some lippy products to work with. I also ordered their foundation, but I ordered that on flip. It has not arrived yet. So when it does, I will share it with y'all. This is what the packaging is looking like. Isn't that bougie? Like, bruh, get into it. That is so freaking bougie. And it has LYS right here. And I love that all their stuff is shaped like triangles. I think that is so cute. And this is what the shade is looking like. Absolutely stunning. Let's see how much product you get. This is how much you get. Not that much. 
much. I feel like a lot of makeup products these days, they're not giving you that much product, but they're charging you more money for those products. But oh yes, that is what your girl is talking about. Okay, that is what I'm talking about. Wait, hold up, I didn't put this on right. Looks like I close it up the correct way. It's some bougie, bougie lip products, so I gotta close it up the right way. Isn't that the most beautiful, cool toned red you've ever seen? I'm gonna hook that look up, okay? With this red lippy, absolutely stunning. And it's gonna dry down matte, I believe, but it doesn't look, it looks more velvety than matte, but maybe, like I said, maybe it's gonna dry down a matte matte color. Let's go for the next lip product. And this one I'm so excited about. Y'all, I'm building up my collection and my collection has to include Pat McGrath Labs. Bougie, black owned, I love it. And this is what the box is looking like. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> like, let's be serious. This packaging is amazing. It's beautiful. Like you just undo the string and then it opens up like this. And then there's your bougie lipstick. I'm finally holding it in my hand. I'm gonna keep the box to this one. The box on the liquid eyeliner wasn't that like bougie, like it was just like a regular box. But this one is very pretty. So I am gonna keep this and add it to my like collection of boxes that I'm hoarding. Let's get into this lippy. Isn't that so freaking beautiful? You got the beautiful luscious lips. And this is in the color Obsess, which I most certainly am. And this is what the bullet part is looking like. Absolutely stunning. Let's look at this, look at this color. Bruh, get into it. That is so freaking beautiful. Obsessed is the right name because I am obsessed with this like orangey kind of color. I think that is so freaking pretty. And this is gonna be a matte finish as well. Absolutely gorgeous. We gotta play with these at some point in time. I think this is gonna be a very beautiful color to wear during summer. So I'm gonna be all in this, all in this lippy for summertime. So yeah, very excited. I think that is so beautiful. And I'm here for it, honey, I'm here for it. It. The next item is something that I wanted to try. Not that I needed any more bronzers, but I did want to try the Hula Bronzer by Benefit. Because everyone talks about the Hula Bronzer, Hula Bronzer, Hula Bronzer. I wanted to talk about the Hula Bronzer. I saw Katie Heron wearing army pants and flip-flops, so I bought army pants and flip-flops. I got me a little itty-bitty mini Hula Bronzer. Isn't that the ittiest of bittiest things you've ever seen? That is so teeny tiny. That means I'll probably be able to pan it. So this is what that looks looks like. This is what the bronzer is looking like. It, it should work for me and my skin tone. I think it should work very nicely. We just have a cute little bronzer we can try out. Um, Nothing too crazy. And the size is perfect for a tester, you know, to just test and see if we like her before we buy the big size. I'm saving the gift for last. And this is the next item that I got. This is the clear tone. Oh no, that's not what it's called. Wait, self-warming? Hold up, self-warming? This thing is gonna heat up? Are you serious? Okay, I didn't know that that was what this was gonna do, but let's just get into it. This is by Restore, and this is the Purifying 2-in-1 Pumpkin Rose Detox Mask and Scrub. It has choline, bromelane, and salicylic acid. It's supposed to smooth, clarify, and improve appearance of pore size. And it says it has self-warming technology. Don't know what that's gonna look like, but this is what the box is looking like. It says, after cleansing, put a generous amount over mouse. Generous amount over the face, massage into the skin for 30 seconds, leave on for up to 15 minutes and rinse thoroughly. One to three times a week and sensitive people should only use it once. Very excited to try this out. At first I was just like, man, it's just a little something, something I could try. But now that I know it's self-warming, oh, <laughs> we gonna play with this during a nighttime skincare routine and see if it really does heat up. But yeah, this is what the product is looking like. Let me go ahead and give it a smelly smell. Bella, I see you over there plotting on my stuff. I see you over there plotting on my stuff. This little girl is so busy. I know you want mommy's things, but you have your own things and mommy has her things. First and foremost, we love a good safety seal. Y'all know over here, we stand a safety seal. That way we know ain't nobody been in our things. Ooh, she thicky thick. Yeah, she thick, thick, thicky thick, that thick. I'm just gonna kind of rub that in. It has like little tiny things in it. I don't know if you can see the little bits. It definitely smells like pumpkin, pumpkin spice. Let's wait and see if it actually heats up. I I'm a little skeptical. I might be able to feel it better if I were to put it on my face. 
We'll have to try it on the face to really see. I mean, it feels like something. I feel I feel something happening. It smells good though. It smells really good. If this is self-warming, it'll probably feel really good to like cleanse your face and then like put this on and then go sit in the shower and let the steam. Oh my God. Next shower, I'm gonna put this on and see if it see if it do what it do. I'm not really seeing any self-warming properties. Maybe I have to leave it on a little bit longer, but I don't wanna sit here for like 20 minutes waiting for this to heat up. We'll try this during a skincare routine and really get the tea on whether this heats up or not. But I'm gonna go rinse this stuff off of my skin and then we'll get into the palette, which was the free gift. The free gift was palette. Now that I've cleaned myself up, the palette that you received, if you spent, I think it was like $60 or something like that, was the Laura Geller, the casual collection, Berry and Blossom eyeshadow palette. And this is what she's looking like. Okay, very cute. I don't own anything Laura Geller. Okay, this is cute. It looks just like the outside of the box. This is a cute little pattern. I think this is so pretty. It's very thin, very, very thin, but very pretty and cute. Let's see, let's see what the inside is working with. All right, so you do get a mirror right at the top and then this is your color story. This is going to be the color story for this palette. So you have some neutrals, you have some purples, very, very pretty. And I like that they have lighter colors as well as the darker colors. This is a more cool toned palette as well. So this will be really nice to play with. I'm gonna go ahead and do a few swatches. I'm not gonna swatch the whole thing, but I will do a few swatches and then check back in. All right, so this is the color story for that Laura Geller palette. I mean, it's okay, it's okay. This wasn't performing as nicely as I wanted it to. It was very patchy when I was trying to like put it on. It took me a few swipes to get the color as opaque as it is on there. These darker shades, focus. Come on. These darker shades are absolutely stunning. I'm very excited to play with the darker shades. This frosty, frosty kind of white color is pretty, but it might just look ashy on me. We'll have to test it out and see. This lighter color is definitely giving ashy. You need some lotion. Go moisturize your skin. We're gonna have to play around with this palette and really see if we like her or not. And that was everything I got during the Mega Drop Shop. What y'all get? Y'all know I'm nosy. I want to know if y'all got anything during this sale. And what do y'all feel about the things that I got? Those lip products were very beautiful. This little girl is so funny. Da, 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 da. Let me know what y'all got while you were shopping if you participated in the Mega Drop Shop. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Febe. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces. Thank you.